what's up guys welcome back to another video it's your girl faith martini today's video we're doing a cook and clean with me plus grocery haul and i'm just showing you the ingredients for the bell peppers that i'm going to be cooking today um so i am going to be using spinach corn diced tomatoes rice um bell peppers uh, ground beef and mozzarella for this recipe i will link the full recipe down below for you if you want to try it but it ended up being pretty good so i really did enjoy it um so i'm starting off by uh, cooking the ground beef and i'm just going to cook it until it browns and then once it browns then i went ahead and added in um the spinach which i kind of chopped up a bit um and the um, white onion to this and then I also added in um, the corn as well and then I just um, sauteed this until the veggies were soft and well cooked and so after that I added in some diced tomatoes and then I also added in tomato paste and uh, black pepper um, salt and onion powder garlic and ginger as well Once that was all well integrated, I added in um, some rice. So this is just a uh, day old rice. And then I also added in um, some cilantro as well. And then I just mixed it all up, making sure that it was well integrated. I actually really liked this filling. It, it was actually really, really good by itself without even putting it into the um, into the peppers. So I think I might just try this by itself another time, but it was really good. So to top everything off, I just added mozzarella cheese um, and I really liked how the mozzarella turned out with this. I've actually never tried it with mozzarella but it was good and then I just baked it um, in the oven for about 25 minutes and this is how they turned out. They were really really good. Um, the pepper was just crunchy enough like it wasn't too soft and it wasn't hard. It was crunchy enough and then everything else just it tasted so well. Um, so this is the final result for the dish that I uh, served for my kids and I uh, once again it was a really really delicious meal for today um, and then I just finished everything and then I put everything away I ended up also baking some a banana bread as well tonight and I didn't really show I didn't really show the bacon for this I just did it uh, while we were eating um, and then I just did it for the next morning so we can have that one for breakfast so I'm just going to put everything away at this point
okay so it's actually the next day the next morning <laughs> i ended up having to like finish everything off the next morning because i was so tired the night before because from cooking and taking care of the boys and everything so i just put on the same clothes and you know decided to continue filming this video so i'm just going to be finishing up by um doing the cleaning for today and just chatting a bit with you guys i know that i haven't really been doing a lot of chatty videos lately like um in my cleaning videos i haven't really been talking much with you all um to be honest there's been so much that has been going on in my life like it's just been crazy um i've been so inconsistent just so much um but i just want to say a huge thank you to all of you for subscribing to my channel right now we are at 93,000 subscribers so we are really close to a thousand two hundred thousand which is absolutely crazy to me um so thank you so much for those of you who are subscribed if you are new here hello and welcome my name is faith martini i am a single mom to two boys i have twins their names are hodari and milambu I post content on motherhood, cleaning, um, lifestyle and all of that. I've been so inconsistent lately because they've just been so much going on in my personal life and since YouTube is about my life, it's just, it's hard to post when my life isn't a hundred, you know, when I'm kind of struggling with something, it's hard for me to get on camera and share um, anything else because it just, it just intercedes with that. So. I've just been really quiet um, trying to get my head right my mind together and just focusing on the important things right now focusing on my relationship with God and also my kids uh, taking care of them so that is what I have been doing so far um, just trying to get my mind in a better state and I feel like I'm in such a good place right now than I have been in a long time, to be honest with you. Um, like I am just, I, I'm feeling so much better. Like I have a lot more control now and yeah, just, I feel a lot better. So I'm definitely trying to pump out as much content as possible. I also started a new channel over at All Things Martini. So that is a channel that I'll be posting, sharing with you my uh, uh, fitness journey because I am trying to lose some weight and then also sharing with you like my journey um, being okay with singlehood, you know, not trying to rush into dating or marriage and just enjoying this time that I'm in. So if you want to see that, if you want to see that content, be sure to um, click on the link down below. I'll list it below and subscribe to that channel. I have only posted one video so far, but I do plan on posting more. It's just been trying, I'm just trying to catch up on everything because I have a lot of content that I need to, to push out. So I'm trying to get caught up on everything that I need to do. But let me play some music here and then we'll get back on this chat. <laughs> Till I woke up with you right by my side I didn't think that you would show up Like you did and you turned my life upside down Oh, your love has got me high I never wanna say goodbye It's like my world's on fire Like my world's on fire This is where we're meant to be Singing to this melody Oh, this melody Got me high, never wanna 
say goodbye It's like my world's on fire Like my world's on fire This is where we're meant to be Singing to this melody Oh, this melody I came across the pink stuff on TikTok and I really like it. Um, it does a really good job of like getting uh, out all of the grease and the stuck on mess on different areas. I will link it down below for you so you can check it out as well. But I'm just using it on my stove top here to um, kind of get rid of some of the um, some of the items that the uh, that my rug wasn't able to take off by itself. Um, and it just, I'm using uh, Scrub Daddy as well to do that, to kind of scrub, to scrub on, um, the product. I really like that combination. I really, really like using the Scrub Daddy. You can see on the sides of my range that I need to clean that area. Um, I, I saw a trick where you can actually use like a knife and, um, a rug to actually do the cleaning and I'm planning on doing a deep clean here soon so watch out for that video but I just used that scrub daddy and uh, the pink stuff and it did a really good job of taking off some of the uh, the stuff that was on the range and then I just had to I would have to use a razor to get rid of the uh, stuff that was stuck around the ring but I didn't do that in this video I'm gonna do it on another video I will be posting you posting a video sharing with you guys um, my favorite cleaning products because somebody actually asked me about that and I know a lot of you are usually curious about what I use so I will do a separate video um, sharing some of the products that I've been liking so far be sure to leave, let me know down below what some of your favorite products are that you like to use in cleaning and also let me know what you're actually cleaning today I would love to know that as well what you're working on if you have a new recipe you're trying or something new that is going on in your life um, I feel like I have really not engaged with you guys as much as I want to um, just because of everything that has been going on so be sure to let me know in the comments engage with me let me know what's going on how you're doing anything new in your life and all the above <laughs> Feeling
so my toddlers have been keeping me really really busy um gosh they are currently two and a half years old and so they are definitely at a stage where they are so excited and curious about every single thing they want to jump around scream do everything <laughs> and i've been trying to just keep up with them i've actually been looking at lots of different activities to you know keep them busy around the home and i'll share that in a, in a video as well i've been sharing some of them on on um instagram but i have been looking for all of these different activities to just keep them active because my goodness when you have two-year-old twins that are just determined to <laughs> to be as energetic as possible it can be quite um quite a task to keep them entertained let me know in the comments what you do to keep your kids entertained if you have toddlers or young kids um, in your uh, work from home or stay at home mom how do you keep your kids entertained because I'm definitely looking for ideas and I have bought a lot of different toys and, um, you know, thinking that, oh, those toys are going to keep them busy. But no, nope, no, nope, the toys do not keep them busy because they'll play with them for five minutes and then they'll be on looking for something else. <laughs> so I've been definitely looking for learning activities. We actually started doing taught school at home. So this is just us like doing in the morning, taking some time to do some learning, um, I'm trying to teach them new words. Uh, we're doing colors and all these different things. So I'll share that in a vlog. Um, and I'll also share some of the toys that I've been using in another video. So let me know in the comments, what are you doing to keep your kids busy? Who knows what you think about me? And I know I shouldn't care. I really tried my best, but I can't make you happy. And I can't stop time for you I don't know why we couldn't work this out Because you know I tried the best I could I don't know how or what I could have done better Baby, I really tried the best I could I can't stop time for you for nothing and I did it all for you for you yeah we've been through this I'm not the one you need right now and I can't stop time for you I don't know why we couldn't work this out because you know I tried the best I could the best I could I can't stop time for you I can't stop time for you I don't wanna be with somebody who's never gonna be around for me Around for me I'm running out of energy, I realize you'll never be the one for me I can't stop time for you I can't stop time for you I'm out. 
out of reasons, I'm out of rhyme But I'll only tell you that I'm out of time I'm sick of love songs, I'm tired of this And I wanna tell you straight just like it is You're watching me like you want me But you're still holding back, still holding back Honestly, you're annoying me With the way that you keep playing Show me your love like it is, like it is And open my heart like you're fearless Steal all the gold you can get, you can get Show me your love, leave me breathless I'm out of patience, I'm out of feels But I guess I'm waiting around for something real I'm going crazy, like what's the deal? Cause I want you to show me what you feel For my cleaning i am going to be i actually have started using hot water now to clean let me know if you do that as well and if it's okay to use it um i i usually use hot water and then i use my mr clean all-purpose cleaner and my um Osida mop and it does a good job of cleaning my floors um i just like to use hot water because you know of the germs and whatnot <laughs> so i've really been liking um doing that so far i'm feeling tired sticking around while you were gone you don't deny it you took me for granted for too long And this is the final product for the kitchen. Um, I actually also wanted to share with you guys a grocery haul from my other apartment um, that I had filmed while I was still there. So I'm going to include that here as well. Um, I have a lot of videos that I filmed while I was in the other apartment that I still need to edit and you know post and share with you guys so you'll be seeing a lot of those uh, coming here as well but here's the grocery haul okay guys so we just got back and I wanted to show you what we got from both um, I went to Costco Sprouts and Walmart so this is all the stuff that I got from Costco okay so starting here i got some kiwi lemons pineapple cheerios mandarins grapes i got some blueberries spinach 
lots of potatoes, <laughs> sugar, um, whatever they're called. Oh, I always forget what these are called. The food snacks, and then bananas. <clears throat> we got some cheese, and I really love this um, tuna milk uh, cheese. It tastes so good to me. Um, and then I got avocado. I got some well, mixed peppers. And then grape tomatoes is a great for salad so I got those and then I got eggs milk butter um, I really love this the last time that I bought it um, the veggie straws they seem to have a lot of salt so hopefully these ones are good but I really love this they're really good snack and the boys really like it too and then I got some almond milk some mushrooms uh string cheese this pepperoni pizza i love their pepperoni pizza it always tastes so good as well i love that and then i got some chicken breast and um what, gosh, what am i forgetting this and um strawberries so that is all that i got from costco and then now i'm gonna show you what i got from walmart
Okay, guys, so these are the items that I got from um, from Walmart, with the exception of this bacon. The bacon is from Costco. Um, I got some ground beef. I'm going to be making chili. I love chili. <laughs> um, I got some steak, stir fry steak, um, asparagus, green beans, cookie mix. We're going to be making some cookies here, and um, shrimp, cilantro, maple syrup, and these are green peppers, tomatoes. I love this Quaker Oats rice cakes. They're so good. Um, we like to eat this with avocado, so they make a really good snack. And then I got some Band-Aid for the boys, some um, antiseptic. I got some baby lotion. I am actually looking for a lotion for my kids. Like I have been using this one since they were babies, but I feel like they're too old for this now i so if you have any ideas for lotion for the use for your kids that you like let me know in the comments because i've been looking for a different one to try and then i bought this um hello hello bello um kids shampoo and body wash and then i got this um dave's bread this is my favorite bread i love this so much the fact that it has four grains kids are here and it has you know seeds and whatnot um it's such a healthy bread so i love it so that's what i got from walmart i didn't really get too many things from there and then i also um i also stopped by sprouts and when i went to sprouts this is what i got from there i usually get these coconut rolls from uh, Costco but I couldn't find them today so I ended up getting them from Sprouts I really love this they taste good as well so I got those and then I got this chili lemon flavored mangoes um, I we used to eat this before when I was in Kenya um, so I definitely want to try this and then I also got this um, snack mix this is something that we used to eat in Kenya as well I saw it recently at um, Sprouts and I wanted to try it, so I can't wait to try that. My son has grabbed something. <laughs> I can't wait to try that. But yeah, so yeah, that's what I got. That's all of the groceries that I got. So now I'm gonna continue putting everything away. Oh yeah, so in total for all of this, I ended up spending about $350. And that's a lot to spend on all of these things, but I know that that's gonna last me. Most of this item, especially from Costco, are going to last me like two or three weeks. So I won't have to buy them. So I won't have to buy this, that, the potatoes, the mandarins, like all these things I won't have to buy for a while. So um, it's, it's worth it for me to spend that much on items that are, you know, that I have to buy in bulk. But yeah, so we'll go ahead and finish putting them away.
So guys I hope you enjoyed today's video I know it was a bit long and I'm gonna post another one similar to this as well but if you liked it be sure to hit the subscribe button for more um, videos let us get to a hundred thousand subscribers oh my gosh it is crazy um, to even think that and also if you're not yet subscribed be sure to subscribe to my other channel all things martini I will list the um, some of the items that I used on this video down below so be sure to check the description box for any item that you may be interested in buying and guys I hope you're having a great time and I will be seeing you on the next video bye bye